Hey guys, um, welcome back to another freebie video. This is everything I got from the 23rd to the 28th, which is today. Um, I'm just going to get straight into it because there's not much and it shouldn't take too long. But I also want to go into detail with some things. So this is just a quick glimpse of everything. So first of all, um, I got all these lovely stickers from if it focuses from www.stickermarket.co.uk so there's their email address as well there for you guys but they just sent me all these stickers took some time focusing then sorry guys so I've got all these, I've got some like big ones, some like see-through ones, some like small ones. My favourite is this parrot one here. Let me get it out. This parrot one and the air balloon one, I like them too. So I've got all those stickers for like samples. I probably check these ones away because I'm not going to use those at all. But these little ones I'm probably just put to stick on the back of like letters or something when I do swaps and stuff just to make it more fun so I did get those then I did get another um, Lotus Biscoff spread um, I got this from Sample Eyes um, thank you to Natasha and I think there was someone else as well but I'm not sure who so sorry if I didn't mention you and um, they introduced me to this app um, so I did get that and also I'll pop Natasha's link down below. So I got that and that came with a 50p off coupon. Then on latest free stuff um, was a link to like samples of wallpaper and fabrics and stuff. Um, and I just wanted a wallpaper mainly because you can use wallpaper samples to do DIY stuff or even to wrap something in your swap up because I find wallpaper protects it a bit more when you're doing swaps. Um, if you watched my swap with Lauren Andrews, then you know um, that I wrapped some of her stuff up in leopard print wallpaper because it protected it more. But I just got this little birdie one for now, well birdie slash owl one for now because I got that. I also ordered some more but I think it's with a different company so I will be getting some more through of that. Okay, so next is this Tesco's magazine. Um, these are all currently free in any Tesco's if you can find them. Um, my local Tesco's in Neef doesn't actually do them no more because not many people pick them up. But I was in my other town, Swansea, just doing some shopping. Um, if you subscribe to my personal channel, which is My Life for my life is Kylie XOX. I'll pop the link below to it. Um, please go over and check it out. I did do a Tesco slash Primark haul over there and I did show this magazine, but I didn't show it in detail because this is what's meant for my preview video. But I got this magazine and at the front it does come with some bargain coupons. So you have a pound off of the holy cow, I think it's cheese. The holy cow sauces or oh, sauces sorry not like cheese 40 pence off any cottage cream Madagascar vanilla custard and thick chanty double cream and it's the cornish one you then have 10 pound off when you spend 75 pound at tesco's opticians um a pound off all of these gluten-free bagels um 50p off um, Imperial Leather Foam Burst 200ml Now I've heard these are really good so I might give this coupon a go if they're not that expensive And you have a coupon to win £100 worth of shopping So that's good and then also in here if I can find it Is 40p off um, Lotus Biscoff Biscuits Then also I just want to show you a little promotion that's going on with Yorkshire Tea If you buy a box of Yorkshire Tea 240 tea bags then you get a free cotton bag inside as well so that was good i like picking those up for the coupons mainly but yeah that was good 
Next from Sample Eyes, um, I got this Flippio Bureau, I think that's what it says, Summer Recipes. Now, lately I've been wanting to cook healthier foods, um, but I want to also cook things to learn to cook better. And having recipe books really helps you cook because it helps you develop. But I'm really interested in cooking this um, chocolate mousse. Well, not cooking, making this chocolate mousse. And also, there's another recipe in here that I like this. This one. But not with the lemon, just with the basil. Um, I love stuff with pastas in. Um, but yeah, I got that from Sample Ice as well because, um, as I said, I was looking for a recipe book to basically just do I got a load of recipe books and stuff that I got from the art foundation as well I've been looking through those but it's just getting the ingredients in to actually make stuff but I got this recipe book then coming down here to this um I signed up to Pampers like ages and ages ago I think it was like a year ago um to for my friend um and I put a random birth date down and obviously the birth of the baby was obviously a couple of months ago or something like that so they've obviously sent me some stuff thing for the baby so they sent this nappy um this midi nappy which i'll pass on to a friend these sensitive wipes which i'm going to use myself because these are good to put in your handbag so i'm going to keep those in my handbag and there's 12 in there they also sent this pound coupon off your next active fit pack and just a load of uh, information and stuff on newborns and their nappies and other products of them. So that was nice of Pampers. Okay, and just above that is from the tanning shop. Now I've seen everyone have the tanning lotion and I did sign up for that, but fortunately it hasn't come, so I am going to get in contact with them about that. Um, but a Twitter giveaway this was on the tanning shop. So go follow them. I'll post their twitter name down below if i can find it if not then it's probably on the back of this but they was giving away this exposed body lotion california tan and this smells amazing but i ain't gonna use it because i'm gonna pass it on um but this is just like information about why you should tan and this just came with a if I could find it, don't tell me what mill it is, but it's like a small bottle of cream to use. The next from the Open University, which I do have one in Cardiff because you go past it on the train on the way to Merthyr Tisdale, I think. Yeah, I think it's there. Um, but it's just this big tiger poster, which I'm going to give to my mum stick on a wall because... She absolutely loves tigers. Her room's like absolutely evaded in tigers and leopard printed stuff. So I did get that. The next I went to shopping, as I said, because I want to go back to Tesco's magazine. I did pop into Debenhams and ask go around all the counters and ask for samples. And I went to Bare Skin first. And they just gave me a sample of my foundation uh, skin type. So it came in this lovely little box. Oh, showing the wrong thing. And it came in this little tube. So I'm going to give that a go one day when I have time to do my makeup because I hardly wear makeup now. And then I went to the clinic, Clinique's store and uh, they gave me this foaming facial soap because I've been looking for a cleanser for a long time. And that's a... Um, doesn't say but it's just like a little sample of that so they go to them and ask them um the rest of the stores didn't have any samples in i couldn't find the lindor i think it's lindor the, the mercy one i don't know what it's called one to get the sample of the serum unfortunately but i did get those then lastly you've probably seen a glimpse of this on when i was showing you these bits be here but i got all this from all this from perina um now, I didn't get this for asking for samples, guys. I actually got all this for doing a complaint. Um, as you know, uh, Latest Free Stuff did have a link for the Perina one. My dog is sample. I never got that. 
and they also had a link the other day for the Purina One cat's food. I never got that either. It took ages for it to come, never turned up. And also the Go Cat, all these samples that you see here, I never received and I did sign up for them. So I got in contact with them, explaining to them that none of it turned up. Also the Gourmet uh, cat's food with the golden spook fork. I never got that either, it never turned up. So I just emailed them saying, look, I'm fed up with this. I'm always applying for your free your samples. Um, I'm not happy. Um, is it possible you can send them out? And they said, sure, tell me what you want you've applied for and I'll think. And I did tell the truth, I didn't lie to get more samples. I said, well, I applied for literally like all of them, the gourmet one. She said, yeah, but that was last year. Did you receive it? And I was like, no. So she sent me a five pound voucher for that, uh, which was lovely of her. Um, and she sent me the rest of the samples for these. So my dog's already had these ones, but it's this Purina one my dog is, and it comes with a little pamphlet about that. Then there's the Purina one like adults cat biscuits and the Go Cat crunchy tender one biscuit in chicken and turkey, and that comes with a. 25p off coupon and then i got this which has been opened because my dogs have been eating these and um, it's just this prina beta adults um in chicken biscuits and then i made a complaint for the bakers i actually bought a box of bakers and it was half full the box was fine nothing wrong with the box didn't look like it was open or anything perfectly fine went to open the box to give my dogs and it was half empty and i weren't impressed so they sent me these coupons, they sent me £10 of coupons and they sent me this one for the gourmet food. So I'm going to pick some of that up for them. But I'm going to go to Swansea another time soon and purchase some stuff from Pets at Home for them because my pets are said to be treated. So I did get all that. Then that's all my freebies for this week guys. Um, a very slow week indeed. Literally a very slow week. Um... Lots of people have probably had a slow week, but um, I just wanted to show everything I got. Even if I had two things, I'd still show you what I got. Um, but I did get all this. Um, only can only do a complaint for to Perina if you actually have one, because I've noticed people just make complaints to get free stuff. Um, but I don't. I actually complain if there's something wrong. Um, you can pop to Boots or Debenhams to get your samples of these. Um, you've got to sign up to Pampers for that, Sample Eyes for that, Twitter for that. Go to the website for that, Sample Eyes and the website for that and go to your Tesco's for that. So I've told you where everything's from and that's from the Open University on latest free stuff. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Um, hope you had an amazing week. Um, so... Yeah, uh, I put Natasha's link down below to her channel and anyone else that I think deserves a shout out as well. Um, so look down below if, if your name's there. You might Your name might be down the description box below. So thanks for watching guys and bye bye. Sorry guys, I forgot one thing. Um, this dress here, if you can see it, was actually free. I have to review it on my blog. But it's a nice, you can't really see because my light's terrible, but it's actually a dark green flowy dress in size 12. Um, oh, I will be doing a video on my other channel to to show you how to look it. But if I hang it on my wardrobe here, it just flows down like this. Um, and at the back, it looks like this. She's got a little bow. And then underneath you have some backspace. And from Twitter they were looking for um, some like bloggers. Um, you did have to have a certain amount of people. But they trusted me because I promised them I'd do a review on my blog and stuff. But this is the name of the company. It's SYCA More. You can see that. Basically I just DM'd them on Twitter. Saying that I'm really interested to um, like try their dresses out or blog some of their clothes and they said sure pick a dress that you want to me do your youtube stuff like this i've sent go through a lot of work with them to get this dress
sorry guys, my video cut off because I had no memory left, but I recovered it now. But as I was saying, it did have I did have to go through a lot of work to get this dress. So don't expect to email them and get something. Um, I think they finished looking for bloggers now for a long time, so I doubt they've got anything. But I did get this dress from, and this dress is actually worth £128, so I'm really lucky to get it. And I just want to say thank you to the brand for letting me review it, and they'll be coming a blog post and a video on how to style it up soon on my other channel. So yeah, now that I've finished guys, thanks for watching, um, please like, subscribe and comment, and I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.